My name is Yusuf Abu Salah. I uh, am the BOT Secretary, Board of Trustees for the Islamic Center of Detroit. By night and by day, I am uh, the postmaster for the city of Dearborn Heights slash Dearborn. Welcome again, and on behalf of uh, the Islamic Center, I'd like to welcome you all and thank you very much for joining us today. During this month of Ramadan, this holy month of Ramadan, Muslims retain from food and drink during dawn, from dawn to sunset. That is what is called a fasting. Ramadan is also a time for spiritual reflection, prayer, doing good deeds, and spending time with friends and family. People who make a special people will make a special effort to connect with their communities and reach out to people who need help. Thank you all for joining us today to break fast and to connect with our community. I'd like to introduce Brother Sammy. Brother Sammy is the, the president of the Dearborn Democratic Club and recording secretary for the Michigan Democratic Party. Please come up to the podium to introduce the Senator. Thank you very much. Uh, good evening, everybody. And uh, again, I would like to welcome all of you to the ICD dinner, uh, Iftar dinner. I would like to have a special thanks to the ICD uh, committee and uh, especially uh, Brother Sufyan and his team for putting this event together. And I also would like to thank the people who made the food for all of us, that they have been working hard all day. Please give them a round of applause. <laughs> With that being said, uh, we do have a special guest speaker tonight. A friend of us who has been a friend of the community for so many years, have supported this community. But at the same time, we also helped her a long way to go. Just recently, she got re-elected to the Senate. And it was really a tough race. In our community, we made a huge difference. The percent of the votes in Dearborn hit record that we have not seen it before. As a result of you contributing into this democratic election, we were able to elect our senator again. Please help me welcome our Senator Debbie Stavell. very, very special for me to have time to break fast with you this evening and to be able to thank you for who you are and what you contribute to our state and to the community. I also bring greetings from my partner in the Senate, Senator Gary Peters. Both of us work hard every single day um, on your behalf and I want to also indicate that uh, we know, and, I, and I'm grateful for the support of the community, very, very grateful in all the work that Sammy was talking about. We know that elections have consequences, and we have an important one coming up in 18 months. And from my perspective, what we have seen in the last two and a half years coming from the White House is just absolutely unacceptable. And so I just want you to know, you know, it, it just breaks my heart to over and over again hear what is coming in terms of words and tweets and travel bans and outrageous statements and so on. And it's not right. It's just not right. So. So thank you again for who you are. I know this is not about politics tonight, but it, in a sense, in, in our world, and our state, everything you know, relates back to what we do together in the community, and part of that relates to who is elected and what their values are. So I am very, very proud to be your partner and to stand with you in this holiest of months as well as all year long, and to thank you for all that you do to make Michigan truly a better place by your values, your faith, 
what you bring to our state. It's, it is making us stronger. And I'm very, very grateful for the fact that you are here. Ramadan Mubarak. Councilwoman Leslie Herrick, can you please come up and say a few words? She's our Councilwoman in the city of Dearborn. Assalamu alaikum. Thank you so much for having me here as one of your honors guests. I just want to tell you from my heart, when I first was asked by friends like, like Sammy Caldy to run for office, um, little did I know how many friends I would make from corner to corner in our city. And I want to thank you for the warm welcome I've felt every time I've been at any one of um, our mosques or any of your events. Uh, I think that this is especially during Ramadan, but I felt it every time we've met. And from my first friends like Sammy and Ali, um, all of you have been so welcoming, and I, I'm glad to share that, and I'm glad to tell other people about it. Because for those who don't understand or don't want or um, don't have opportunities to meet people from other cultures, I'm glad that I'm able to help do that on your behalf in building these bridges in our city and across our country. So thank you for your welcoming spirit and all that you do for the people of Dearborn. We will be bringing up our councilman from District 7 in one minute. But I have uh, an individual that like he's leaving and we want to catch him before he leaves. Our 19th District Court Judge, Judge Summers, can you please come up and say a few words? He has another engagement. He was on his way out the door and Mr. Hamad caught him. Here we go. I want you to know I was the one of the first people here though. I was here at 7.59. The sun was shining brightly. I was here. And I, I'm most pleased and honored to, uh, to greet you and to say to you, Ramadan Khalid, I feel that that old saying that it takes a village, I live in this village and I love this village. It's in my heart. I grew up in a village in India and this has been the blessing of my adult life to find myself so I'm living in Dearborn for the rest of my life. Thank you, John. Thank you, John Gabe Leland, please help me. Gabe, uh, welcome Gabe Leland, who serves as the, the Detroit City Councilman in District 7. He is, this is his district, 48228 is Council Leland's district. Please help me welcome him. He is a devoted fourth generation Detroiter working hard to create positive change in his community since he was elected in November 2013. With ample experience, he aims to create dialogue and affect positive change. Please help me welcome Gabe Leland. Thank you so much. What a lovely evening. This is exceptional. I wanted to uh, thank the, the great uh, men and women of this amazing community, uh, and including uh, ICD, for all of their work. And so, let's give ICD a round of applause. Um, this, this incredible community, uh, this incredible religious community, has done some amazing work uh, in the city of Detroit, and obviously, uh, for, for many people and many populations and um, you know it's something when you sort of just have a, a, a wherewithal of going outside of your church and engaging uh, with the community around you and ICD uh, has definitely done that in so so many ways and so um, you know many of you know that I have a, a big appetite but you know I, I'm not just here to eat I'm, I'm here to engage I'm here to um, you know, get to know more uh, folks from ICD, and this is a time to celebrate. And so, I'm so blessed uh, to have that relationship with uh, with their community and with ICD. Uh, I do uh, represent this great community in the Detroit City Council in District Seven on the West Side, and uh, we are truly one Detroit. Um, and I, I promote, I try anyway, to promote that diversity of our great city 
every single place that I go. And so, uh, to all of you, happy Ramadan.